Right now, at least three young girls say 41-year-old Andrew Seal touched them inappropriately, and prosecutors say Seal himself admitted it. He worked at the Daystar Child Care on North Rural and Washington. Our crime bureau reporter Steve Jefferson is outside that daycare after breaking the news of his arrest and charges earlier today on Facebook. Steve? In court documents, the suspect actually admitted to touching the children here at Daystar Child Care. The facility is fully cooperating with investigators and has since made some changes to make sure this doesn't happen again. Marion County prosecutors slapped Andrew Seal with multiple counts of felony child molestation. The 41-year-old worked as a preschool teacher here at Daystar Child Care connected to Inglewood Christian Church. In court documents, a four-year-old told her mother, Mr. Andy touches her in the classroom while other kids are sleeping. In the same document, Seal reportedly admits the inappropriate touching happened on three different occasions in April of 2016. Someone the child knows. Child abuse expert Emily Perry owns and operates a chain of child advocacy centers. Her expert interviewers are trained to detect when a child has been victimized because usually there are signs. There may be things like bruises, rashes, irritations, infections, things of that nature. Um, that's not very common, but there can be those signs that people could see. More often than not, we'll see behavioral changes in children. So far, police say Andrew Seal has confessed to sexually abusing three young girls. And just like his former employer, they hope there are no other victims out there. Either way, Emily Perry wants parents teaching and talking to their kids about guarding their bodies. Start that conversation early and talk to them about body safety often. As part of the new rules here at Daystar, no employee can ever be alone with children. Andrew Seal is scheduled to go to court on three counts of child molestation in December. On the Crime Beat, I'm Steve Jefferson.